हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड डेटा रिप्रेजेंटेशन डेटा रिप्रेजेंटेशन इज आल्सो नोन एज नंबर रिप्रेजेंटेशन वी विल अंडरस्टैंड डिफरेंट वेज ऑफ रिप्रेजेंटिंग ए नंबर देयर आर थ्री बेसिक वेज हाउ वी कैन रिप्रेजेंट ए नंबर फर्स्ट टाइप इज बाइनरी रिप्रेजेंटेशन which is given by base 2 so base 2 represents binary number representation or binary data representation consists of two numbers which is 0 and 1 so binary number system consists of only two numbers which is 0 and 1 that's why it is having a base 2 second type of number representation is decimal number representation or it is also known as binary representation which is having base 10 which means it is having 10 numbers 10 numbers which means from 0 to 9 after 9 we can represent this number as 10 which we call that as 10 11 which is known as 11 12 which is known as 12 13 which is known as 13 and so on third type of number representation is hexadecimal representation which is having base 16 or it is also known as base h sometimes we write that as base 16 or base h if we say base 16 which means it is having 16 numbers so 16 numbers which means it is having number from 0 to 15 so in this hexadecimal number system we will write numbers from 0 to 9 after 9 we'll write the numbers in the form of alphabets from 10 to 15 so 10 will be represented as a 11 will be represented as b 12 as c 13 as d 14 as e and 15 as f so hexadecimal number system is having 16 numbers from 0 to 15 so we'll write numbers from 0 to 9 after 9 we'll write a b c d e and f for 10 to 15 numbers so it is shown in this table as you can see a decimal number is having number from 0 to 9 after 9 will represent it as 10 11 12 13 14 15 and so on hexadecimal number is having numbers from 0 to 15 so from 0 to 9 we'll write the number after 9 we'll write a b c d e and f so a represents 10 b represents 11 c represents 12 d represents 13 e represents 14 and f represents 15 now using these number representation we can convert one form of number representation into another form of number representation for example if we want to convert number 6 into binary number we will represent a binary number in the form of 4 bits so you can see here we are representing 6 as 0 1 1 0 we should remember that binary number will be having the value for each positions since we are taking four bit binary number each position will be having its own value from right towards left so if we are taking four bit binary number so it will be having four positions like 2 to the power of 0 2 to the power of 1 2 to the power of 2 and 2 to the power of 3 so 2 to the power of 0 is having value as 1 2 to the power of 1 is 2 2 to the power of 2 is 4 2 to the power of 3 is 8 now for example 
a decimal number 6 is given now this 6 should be converted into binary number so we will use this to convert 6 into binary number so if you observe here we are having 4 here and we are having 2 here so 4 plus 2 it is 6 so corresponding location is made as 1 and other two location is made as 0 so 6 in decimal can be represented as 0 1 1 0 so which is shown in this table so 6 can be represented as 0 1 1 0 in the same way we can take an hexadecimal number so let us say the number is a this should be converted into binary number so we will use the same analysis to convert it into a binary number so a is nothing but 10 so we need to represent 10 in the form of binary number so if we see this location is having the value as 8 and this location is having the value as 2 so 8 plus 2 is 10 so that's why we will make these two position as 1 so remaining two position is made as 0 so 10 can be represented as 1010 10 in binary so as you can see here 10 can be represented as 1010 in binary which is same as a in hexadecimal that can be represented as 1010 now let us take an example where we need to convert hexadecimal number a3 into binary so we can see from this table a is having equivalent number 1010 and 3 is having equivalent binary number as 0011 so we can combine those two number and we can write the binary equivalent of hexadecimal number so a can be represented as 1010 and 3 we can write it as 0011 so we can combine these two number a3 we can represent in the form of binary as 1010 and for 3 we can write it as 0011 so we have combined these two numbers and we have written a3 as 1010011 to base 2 let us take the second example where we need to convert this binary number to hexadecimal number so what we need to do we need to write this binary number 11101 0 0 0 so we need to group in the form of four bits so from right towards left so we will take first four bits we will group that one and we will take second four bits and we will group that number so we got the first group which is having the number 1 0 0 0 so if you look at this table 1 0 0 0 the equivalent hexadecimal number is 8 so we can write the equivalent number as 8 and the second group is having the number 1110 so if you observe this table where we are having 1110 equivalent hexadecimal number is e so we can write that equivalent hexadecimal number as e so we got 1110100 this binary number is equivalent to e8 which is the hexadecimal number so this is how we can do the conversion here you need to remember if we take four binary digits so binary digit is also known as bits so generally we call this as bits so which is a short form of binary digit if we take four binary digit we call that as nibble so if we take four binary digits we call that as nibble so for example if you take 1011 so we are taking four binary digit so this is known as nibble so we understood that nibble is four bit of data four bits is known as nibble if we take eight bits eight binary digits so we call that as byte so if you take 8 binary digits or 8 bits we call that as byte for example you can take 10101101 so it consists of 8 bits so we call this as a byte if you take 16 bits 
we call that as word if you take 16 bit binary number we call that number as word similar to this if we take 32 bit binary numbers so we call that as double word so we can say that 4 bit binary number is known as nibble 8 bit binary number is known as byte 16 bit is known as word and 32 bit binary number is known as double word so this is about data representation hope you have understood the topic thank you